Do you ever go back and revisit ideas, or is it for new Once in a while, fresh? once in a while, but we always try to write fresh for every record and not use any old ideas, because we look at each record as a time capsule of where we're at at that time. And you know, it might have be some quality music that we've written before that didn't get used, but we usually just kind of let it dissolve because it's always everything we write or come up with is always a part of our DNA and the way that we create, anyways. So, um, but we try to, you know, not do what we were doing before. We're always trying to be curious and make ourselves vulnerable to wherever we're at at this, at the present point in our lives, and to use that as the inspiration for what we're writing. So yeah, not really, not really, but. But you know, beyond like writing tracks that 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 don't get used and that never get used, and you know that we think are really good, there's also like you know we just jam a lot. Like we spend a lot of time just improvising, jamming, and kind of really going to the center of our creative selves. And none of that ever gets used. You know, once in a while, like a little piece of a jam would be, oh, that would be good for a song. But it's like we just jam to jam and. I feel like that's what makes us, like the thing about the Chili Peppers that I think that, that people really connect with, you know, outside of, you know, good songs or whatever, is the fact that we spend so much time jamming and connecting with each other and finding a thing about us collectively that is a unique thing that just comes from spontaneous improvisation that's not from, okay, let's write a song that can be played on the radio or even a song just to write a song. But just jamming, and there's just like hundreds of thousands of hours of music that we play that will never ever be heard. But it's the thing that teaches us how to go to that sacred place within ourselves where the good ideas are at.